Dean, a point against the league leaders today. Your thoughts after that performance? Uh, not good enough in the final tour. Um, kept some good players quiet. Obviously, we had a break where, where they went down to 10 men and then we made, we made the pitch as quick as we could. Uh, sorry, as big as we could. And um, our passing was slow. We weren't crisping up on our passing to move them. But in the end, we had two or three glorious opportunities to win the game as well. So I'm really frustrated, really, we haven't took all three points. Really had some great opportunities in that second half, especially Moyo's at the end. In that second half as well, game really changed when that red card happened. Did you see what happened? Nah, I couldn't see from where I was. I haven't got a clue. So now that'll be on the box and we'll see it on there. So yeah, the game did change and it gave us the impetus to go win the game. And we weren't good enough to go win the game. You made some uh, changes after that red card. Nicky Kabamba came on. Was that just because you wanted to get, get that uh, extra man up front? Nah, it was always the plan to put Nicky on. Um, we didn't want to play Smudger as long as we did. Um, you see even the chance he had at the back post, he just a little bit leggy when he was jumping up for that. So um, some of the lads, you know, they've been out injured and that. So we just got to manage the lads' minutes, really. You talk about ma managing minutes. It was great today to uh, Jerome Akimo, Harry Smith, Jordan Cropper all back into the start on 11 today. How great is it for them to get some minutes today? They're massive players for us. Huge, huge players for us. Um, I thought Cropsey was outstanding. Akimo did really well as well. Smith just looked a little bit leggy, a little bit tired. Um, so that's just a natural thing. But really, he's been out since the quarter-final of the FA Trophy. That's when he picked up the injury originally, so he's been out a long time. Obviously, frustrating that we couldn't get the win with those opportunities, but a point against the league leaders is a point in the right direction. I think I said before the game, um, when I did the previous interview, it's important we don't get beat today, but we had an opportunity to win the game. And if that happens to us, you know, obviously we've got to get ourselves into the playoffs. Um, and that was a great opportunity to do that. And really, what do we have? 25 minutes, they were, down to, they were down to 10 men, so we just weren't good enough for that department. Really frustrating. Three massive league games now, starting with Solihull on Tuesday. How are the next few days going to look for the team? Yeah, recovery for the lads tomorrow. Hopefully we can recover well and see how to patch the lads up, see how they are, get ready Monday morning, go again. And uh, we'll, like we do with every, every team we play against, um, we do our homework, so we're very humble and respectful of them. So Solihull are a good side. I think they've just had a season where... If you look at their, their season, um, I think they only had a three or four week break in the off season because they played the playoff final. Um, so I think that's, that's damaged in this season, but they've got a top manager and they've got some really good players. Dean, thank you for your time.